Another way to stream from Unreal Engine to major platforms is to use Streamlabs. Streamlabs provides many templates that you can stream from so that you can VTube while you're playing games or sharing content with your viewers. These presets are already configured, so it's a very easy to use tool. In this tutorial, we'll be showing you how to use the Owl Spout Sender to stream to Streamlabs for this game overlay view. If you haven't done this already, create an Owl Cinecam in your scene, click on this drop down and create a new render target and save it in your assets folder. You'll also need to apply the same render target in the Cinecam. Instead of framing for a full body view today, I'm just going to go for the torso and more of a close up look for this game view overlay. As we will be overlaying this character on top of different displays or game views, I will also need to add alpha support to this. That is, to only take the character without the environment to OBS Studio. Below render target, expand the alpha settings and add your metahuman blueprint to the show only actor slot. Now you can check use shown only list. This will only take the character alpha on the render target and stream it via spout. Then we will need a spout sender manager in our scene. Add a sender and select the same render target here. Make sure that active is checked. It will generate a name for you automatically, so don't need to worry about that. Before we go to Streamlabs, you will need to change one project setting for your alpha support. On project settings, search for alpha and set to allow through tone mapper. This will allow us to stream alpha to Streamlabs. Once this is done, we can now set up Streamlabs. For this, you will need to install the Windows version for Streamlabs. Once it has successfully installed, you can now open it up. I've selected live streaming as my main purpose for using Streamlabs, and so it will guide you to connect your account to other accounts on these streaming platforms. Using Twitch as an example, it will guide me to the authorization page. Once authorized, Streamlabs and your Twitch account will be connected for seamless streaming. For this tutorial, I'll be starting fresh on a blank template. Here, I'll guide you to set up a mic and webcam. As we're streaming as a VTuber, we can leave the camera setting for a placeholder for now. You might want to choose a theme for your stream, so I'm just going to choose a basic dark theme here and join Streamlabs as a starter. Now you'll see that we're in the feed editor section. All we need to do here is to add a new source and select Spout2 Capture as your source. As I already have my Unreal open, my Spout feed is already showing up here, so just resizing the stream to the corner and then removing the template frames. Now you can choose any window or full screen game to stream. Click go live and as you can see here streaming to Twitch is already configured and so click confirm to go live and there you go. Let me swap to my game view and let's start streaming.